Legion of boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to another Ouya video today. Why don't we look at this guy over here? Where is it? Overdroid challenge platformer. This game, if I remember right, uh, there was no, there is no playable demo. Oops, wrong button. So I forget how much the game was. Uh, play. I'm gonna have to look that up and. Me in the future. Put it down here in the corner how much the game actually is. Uh, I'll look it up on my receipt and play it. Anyways, so yeah, I originally played a little bit of this, as you can see here, but my A record decks was slowing down the gameplay tremendously. So I thought I'd play it here, see if this new record deck. By the way, there's the controls. Oh yeah, wow. I, um, what I'll do here is I'll actually. Well, hold on. So on the next level, I'll do a split screen to show you what the old record deck was recording at and what the new, uh, not this is the what the A record deck was recording at, what the B record deck was recording at. So here, show you the difference between the two. So before you finish, you got to get this one here, which opens up the exit. So yeah, show you a oops, a comparison of the little guy's a bit sensitive. Ah, see, I keep trying to hit sideways, but he also hit, gets a, uh, senses me pushing up a little bit, and he jumps automatically. A bit sensitive, but man, game opens up a lot more once you actually have the proper speed. Ah, I missed one, shite. Anyways, let's go on the top rope here. Oh, shite. Missed one, so I'm not gonna get a perfect score on that. Oh, I still got three stars. Okay. All right. So yeah, again, this is kind of a, one of these platformer collectibles. Ah, oh, shite. How am I supposed to get up there? Hold on. Okay, so if I go over here, jump here. Hold jump to activate. Uh, I see. I don't like how touchy the controls are on that. Might just be my controller starting to give out on me. Oh yeah, I could go here. Can't get that, so I need this power up, don't I? So I can now glide. <laughs> flap those wings. Flap, flap, flap like your uh, teenage boy that just discovered the internet. Let's go on. So you can get power ups here. Oops, and you can't actually die, so it's not a uh, complete cape walk. All right, let's go back up here, back up here. There we go. Yeah, so it's a nice little simple platformer shite. Am I supposed? Am I supposed to jump over here? Yeah. Of course, you risk losing time by collecting all, but you also get a higher score by collecting more. All right. Ah, oh, I totally got that. Anyway, slap, slap, slap. All right, here we go. Nope, not gonna happen. Ah, uh, just kill yourself and get it over with. Shake, shake, shake. Yes! Just in time. Wasn't there a game called Just in Time? Oh well. Let's just finish the game. You've already been at this for a couple minutes there. So you do have a timer in the upper left. Gravity change. Whoa, Nelly. And that lasts for 27 seconds. Come on, one more. Oh well, let's just press Y to return to normal. Oh, I see. Got it, just in time. So by the way, can I change it back and forth? No, I can't, okay. So once you cancel it, that's canceled for good. You can't bounce back and forth. 
By the way, does that kill me? Yes, it does. Just wanted to check. Kind of thought so, but it's always good to check. Look at that. Look at that little droid go. You go, D-Roid. Oh, what was it? Uh, Overroid? So I need a gravity change here, don't I? Alright, drop down. Be safe. Magnetic powers. Oh, nice. So it's not a... I, I see. Very nice. Anyways, drop down. That's usually a power-up they force you to buy later on in the game or something like that, but... Whew. Oh, come on. You're ruining your perfect score. No. Whew, that was close. Ugh. Again, it's a bit touchy with the jump. If up wasn't jump, I think the controls would be a bit more smoother. If I wasn't drinking, this also be a bit more smoother. So I missed all those because I took too long and lost my magnetic power-up, so... My bad. Alright. Oh well. Yeah, I was gonna kill myself there, just because this is... What has it been? Nine levels? So yeah, there's a quick enough look, I guess. Oh, there's a shop. Uh... You can... Oh, I see. So you get those golden gears, I guess, by uh, achieving perfect scores. Hmm. Double skill timers. Force field. Extra locator. Helps the location of the exit items. Very nice. So what are my goals then? Oh, I see. You get goals for achievements. I see, I see. So if I jump 500 times, I get two. If I green quest, kamikaze, die 500 times. That one I'll achieve pretty easily. And you get four for that. Nice. Uh, jump 5,000 times. Die 2,000 times. Again, I'll probably get that one first. Mind. How did I get... Oh, wow. So you can do the first level of each. I see. So I could jump here to the mind right away. Oops. Anyways, so yeah, again, it's a nice little platformer. I forget what the what the actual price of the game is. Hopefully, if I didn't put it in the beginning, I'll put it here again uh, in post, as they say. I'll let you guys know how much the game was. But again, I played it before, but my record deck slowed it down. Hopefully, you guys got to see a comparison. But who knows? It depends on if I actually paid attention while editing. <laughs> anyways, anyways, I'm rambling. So there's a quick look at the game. Thanks again for watching, and see you next time.